excited about the start on Saturday and uh, looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to the crowd and um, I'm just psyched about that I, I got to uh, be announced to be a starter, so I'm pretty excited. Talk about, I guess, what you're uh, expecting and what you're hoping. You know, do you have any plan of action or is it just um, you know, you know, I'll try to keep my mind right as in uh, just uh, settle down in front of the fans. I heard it's going to be pretty pretty amazing and uh, pretty loud. And uh, I try to zone out everything and just focus on what I'm here to do is play baseball. Now you're a kid from Texas, right? So what's your first impressions coming here to Brooklyn? Especially look out, you see all that uh, amusement parks out there, you know. What's your first impressions of this place? Uh, you know, my first impressions would be uh, just um, the stadium is amazing. And um, New York is great, big city, you know, and I'm from a pretty big city in Houston, so I'm from the city, I'm not from the country, like everybody thinks of Texas, but uh, um, my expectations were, uh, I've been to New York for a couple days, and um, so pretty excited, and I like the city, and being comfortable here. Have you had a chance to explore um, I went down to Manhattan to go shopping a little bit, and um, and just explore the how the big city works and there's a lot of people I've taken the subway which was pretty exciting for me. I you know wasn't expecting the way it worked and everything and um, but that's all I've been so far. I hear a lot of people talk about the a lot of players talk about that the fans are talked about here and you know the attendance stuff like that. What exactly are you expecting? Is it is this a, a special minor league environment from what you've heard? Oh yeah absolutely uh, the crowd's gonna be crazy and um, you know, I was in GCL, the lowest level in uh, minor leagues uh, for the Mets, and there's no fans, there's nothing there, and uh, seeing them play in this big stadium and talking about the crowd, you know, like I said, I'm just going to try to block it all out and focus to pitch, you know? It does give you a little more juice knowing that you know, you're going to have a packed house and oh, you're out there? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, I kind of like pressure, honestly, you know, I look forward to the, the thrive and the, um, the adrenaline that goes through my body, and so I'm pretty excited. Uh, the things I've improved on the most would probably be, uh, I was kind of uh, worried about my stretch working out when there's a runner on, you know, I was kind of uh, weak on some of my pitches, but in the off season and uh, instructionally for about three weeks after our season got over in, um, in the GCL. Um, we worked on nothing but stretch, and uh, so I actually feel more comfortable in the stretch now and with all my pitches, and uh, when a runner gets on, I'm not worried about what I'm doing wrong. Going to the what do I think about it? What do you, what do you think made you burn most? Oh, okay, um, probably the way I pitched during my spring training. You know, I don't think uh, a lot of people were expecting me to be here, but uh, I worked really hard my offseason. I uh, just pushed through to try to get stronger and get my arm built up. So uh, through the three months spring training that we did have, I was strong the whole way, and I just uh, kept trying to uh, pitch at my best every outing. And um, I guess that would be, would be uh, what earned me a spot, is just working hard and uh, pitching the way I needed to be. Now, someone with your build, you know, six foot seven, how is how important is it for you to use that build, especially that stride? Is that something that you are always working on, getting that downhill motion? Yeah, and um, you know, some people don't use their height to their advantage, and uh, I really do because I throw way up top, not like sidearm or uh, three quarters. You know, I'm really up top and uh, downhill, and I think that's what helps me the most. Is you know, and during inter squad in our uh, spring training. We kind of had like uh, inner squads a lot instead of playing against different teams. So some of my teammates here were telling me, you know, it's kind of hard for you to hit because whenever a pitch comes from up top and it, it's coming downhill, it could look like it's high, but it's going to be a strike. And um, so I try to use my height to the best advantage that I can get. Is there anything else that you feel that you could bring to the Cyclones this coming year? And, uh... Um, I'm hoping to uh, get a lot of wins and uh, get the fans to love me, you know, and uh, just go out there and play the game that, that I love to do. Um, I think our uh, defense is going to be really solid, and we have to, we do have a, a lot of uh, strong hitters and power hitters, but I think our hitting is going to come well together, and uh, overall I think we're going to be a great team.